multifamily housing professionals from around the world pour into the Exposition Hall at the 2013 NAA Education Conference and Exposition. I'm Ed Hyland, and this is NAA TV. are being inspired, learning about the latest innovations and making connections right here on the show floor. Graffiti artist Eric Wall opened Friday's session with a dynamic presentation sponsored by Azuma. He challenged attendees to take a risk and disrupt their pattern of familiarity. The core of the message is to think different, that we've been taught and trained and disciplined our whole lives to think in a very uh, structured pattern where I think success and truly opportunity is going to lie in how to unthink or to differentiate or think differently going forward, to unlock and unleash our minds. A couple of lucky attendees took one of a kind Eric Wall paintings home with them. One was given a painting simply for coming up on stage. The other had to follow clues on social media to win an art drop of a unique Sir Richard Branson painting hidden somewhere in the San Diego Convention Center. But everyone left energized and ready to put Wall's tips into action. I think you just need to be inspired by different things and to be able to be creative with what you do and go to the next level. Don't restrain yourself from thinking the norm. Think outside the box. NAA also puts a huge emphasis on education. A pair of thought leaders took to the stage Friday. How did our mother and our father know who were lying? Janine Driver set out to help attendees discover who was lying to them. As a consultant to the CIA and police agencies, her tune-up to your natural BS barometer included ways to read body language and spot ways people try to hide the truth. The You Can't Lie to Me program was a lesson learned. She's very uh, inspiring, she's educational as well, and she puts a nice funny spin to it, so you retain it and kind of take it inward and it works out really well. Yeah, she's fantastic. Look at it from an NAA conference perspective. I think that we can go into a lot of sessions at the conference and it doesn't touch you anywhere near as personally as this. She certainly bridged that gap between we're talking about our workplace and our work ethic and our, our business procedures. She's talking about our personal lives and us as human beings and I think that just connects so deeply with us. I did a lot of research on what was important, what are the buzzwords, how can I take what I've taught to the CIA and the FBI direct from those playbooks and apply it to this industry of the apartment associations to help them protect their bottom line, help them protect their team, make sure they're not hiring or hiring people to work with them, or putting people in your apartments that are viruses. Why should we be interested in young people? Thought leader Michael Wood set out to make sense of millennials. The senior VP for True says the next generation of renters is not only powerful, but they're rewriting rules for engaging with brands and how companies connect with them. Social media rules and the current economy affects them more than the previous generation. True is the world's leading research firm specializing in teens and 20-somethings. My message to this group is to really focus on user reviews and uh, utilize those advocates that they have that are satisfied with their properties and, and see if they can't find ways to encourage them to, to act as ambassadors for them. With nearly 400 exhibitors, the NAA Exposition gave attendees a chance to learn the latest industry trends. Definitely something you know to look for, and that's where direct, you know the companies are going to be headed. And so we want to make sure we have great content on our site, and we're doing that, as I said, through the HD photos, the panoramic tours, and something we're calling certified ratings and reviews. I've gotten some great ideas out of this, out of some of the sessions that I'm going to take back and, and share with my folks. Uh, I think a lot of it, though, we get from the trade show floor and some of the products and ideas and, and some of the stuff that we can get to take back and implement company wide. Also part of the exposition, networking in a casual setting at NAA meetups. Attendees gather to share best practices in their industry. Friday sessions focused on finance and those who are relatively new to multifamily housing. But honestly, the networking piece of it is my favorite part of the day. Absolutely, I plan to be here next year. New technologies and the networking is 
awesome. And I really enjoy the motivational speakers too. Three grand prize drawings and the crowning of a winner in the Walk This Way pedometer contest kept a busy day at NAA. Attendees were encouraged to pick up a pedometer from sponsor Criterion Brock and track their steps for the day through San Diego. Woo! Thank you, NAA! Best conference ever! And the winner is three lucky attendees, winning a total of $20,000 in cash prizes. They said the winner is Dan, and you were kind of on the edge of your seat because yeah, there's a lot of Dan. Yeah, I was on the edge of my seat. There not, not a lot of Dan's around. I thought, oh my God, I got a, at least a 20% chance of winning. Maybe even more than that, and then they said the last name, and then of course I know I had it. <laughs> but yeah, it's exciting. Uh, I've never won anything like this in my life. For now, I'm Ed Highland. Thanks for watching NAA TV.